Hey, I just tried to make a peanut butter and jelly sandwich for my daughter and I accidentally ate some of it and it is so good that I'm going nuts here wanting another one, even though it's almost dinner time. So I'll show you what I'm dealing with here. Okay, I bought this keto bread because I thought, hmm, it must have more thought put into it than regular wheat white bread, which I refuse to buy. Um, and I usually buy the gluten-free, but it's, you know, rock hard. So here we go. Now the whole way this began was because I found this jar in the fridge. And as a super Virgo person, I've got to say, I can't keep this in the fridge like that. So I decided to already make my daughter's snack for tomorrow. So I'm putting on some jam. By the way, this is pretty awesome. It's made without sugar. It's sweetened by apple juice. Of course, best is if you make your own jammy. And I've done that, but I'm using this one. Next, almond butter. I hope I don't get fired for playing Adele. Okay, and then, voila. I know this is simple 101 land, but this tastes so good. Here we go. Cutty cut. <laughs> I think it's because I grew up on whole wheat or homemade bread, so this looks <laughs> like delicious to me. Here we go. I have to get my tea because this is gonna be sticky. Okay, let's get made better. All right, bon appetit. It's almost dinner time. Here we go. I just don't know what she means at this part of the song, but I think it's an English thing. Anyway, I like it. It's, I have to be honest, I wouldn't eat it every day, um, but like Michelle Obama, every once in a while, this is really good. Bon appetit. Let me know what you would do.